Hello and welcome to tutorial number 37 on the Community Builder 2.0 series. Uh, my little black book it tells us that today I'll be discussing the text area field. I'll be showing you how to use substitutions in field and tab titles. And we're going to be creating a tab that's only viewable uh, to CB moderators in the front end. So let's just go right ahead and create a new field in, so I'm in the tab area, sorry. Let's create a new field, first of all, in field management area. Okay, type of field, let's select the text area. Text area. If I scroll down, let's keep it on the contact info tab for now. Turn it off registration, so to no. And let's set the column and row size. Let's set it, for example, 20 columns and five rows, for example. And let's just give it a name here about user. And a title about, and instead of user this time, let's just put username as a substitution. So we'll actually see the username of the profile being viewed in the title of this field. Okay, let's just save and close. And go to the front end and log in as a user. Password. Okay. And visit this person's profile. We'll see the contact info has about Antonis. It's very cool. It took the username substitution and dragged in the name of the user. Now, if we do an edit here, we'll see in the contact info tab there's this little text area box which is basically uh, 10, 10 rows by 30 columns <clears throat> and we could put a message here very active on site period and we can have a second message here brought three new members update There we go, we have these here. Now, let's assume we want this specific field uh, to be put in a tab, and that tab is only viewable by a moderator looking at this user profile page. So what we go, we go to the back end, community builder, tab management, add a new tab. Let's call this tab again about Let's use the same concept, substitution username. Okay, and instead of public, let's collect CB moderation view. And let's the position be canvas main middle and the display being tab menu. Let's just save and close this. <clears throat> and then go back to the field management area. Select this field I created earlier and place it from the contact info tab, place it in this new about username tab. And save and close it. Now, if I go to the front end and refresh Antonis, the field is no longer here, and there's no tab shown. Now, let's log in as a user moderator. Fenya is one of my moderators. And... <coughs> Let's go to Fenya's page, for example. We should see 
this About Fenya tab here because she's a moderator, so she can see that tab even on her own profile. But let's visit the Antonis profile now. There we go. And we'll see, Fenya can see the About Donis tab and the message here that we have. So this is a nice way of uh, giving your moderators extra information about their uh, users. And if we configure things and we allow user to, or to allow moderators to edit users profile, they can just update the profile here and go to the About Andonis page and add another comment. Very helpful. Gave him two points. An update. And we see the updated message here. Very helpful. It gave him two points. We can put even dates here if you want in the messages. It depends on how you want to use this. Okay, I think I've covered the topics I had scheduled. Thanks for watching again. Stay tuned for future videos. Bye-bye.